My name is Laura Jane Miller. I'm an infant, child, and adolescent psychiatrist, um, board certified in child adolescent psychiatry as well as adult psychiatry. Treatment in infant and early childhood really begins with assessment. An assessment for an infant looks different than what it does for an older child. I spread out my assessments over at least three weeks. First, where I meet with parents and I hear their entire story of what it was like to become a parent to this child. Um, in addition to collecting really specific information around the pregnancy, risk factors, protective factors, um, the labor, and the postpartum period. And then once I've developed a rapport and I feel like I at least understand the child from the parent's perspective, then I move to an observation where I just watch the child with the parent, um, typically one parent at a time, sometimes both <laughs> in the, at the same time. And um, depending on the age, we put them through a few different situations to see how they relate to one another and to see what this child looks like within the context of the, their relationship with their parents. So a dyad is, is the focus of the treatment for children under five. I really break the dyad down into three patients in my mind. There's the infant, there's the parent, and then there's the space in between the relationship. And so after I've done my assessment, I'm able to figure out where we really need to focus our, our energies. But it's always including parents as key, key players in what the goals are of treatment um, and uh, how, how to better support the child and help them find one another. And treatment and therapy can look different based on the needs of the family. There are a few evidence-based therapies that will um, lean on in a more uh, structured way when needed, like parent-child interaction therapy is what's done at our clinic. Um, we have trauma-focused cognitive behavioral therapy as well. It helps the child tell the story of what happened to them and the preschool age kiddos. And then there's um, a lovely trauma therapy called child-parent psychotherapy that's play-based um, and includes the caregivers the whole time. I, I want to say that treatment in general, like taking taking out the lingo of these specific therapies, treatment looks like finding connection um, between parent and child, finding the secret synchrony, telling stories together, um, listening and containing intense emotions from, from parents and from children and helping them through misunderstanding to like a, a more solid, understanding of one another, um, helping discard the past and what's happened to the parent and really bring them into the present moment with their child so that they can understand in starker detail, like their specific child's strengths and weaknesses to empower them to be able to support the child exactly where they are. My intent is that we slow down, we learn the whole story of the child's development, we understand the family, and we work collaboratively with parents um, to empower them and not just give prescriptive advice. Um, I, and, and we use medications as a, as a last resort. To, to understand a child under five, you need to understand them in the context of their relationships 